Hey macarons. Hey macarons. So today we're here. I'm wearing the head camera. Oh snap. We're gonna make a quick video on how to make a binocular projection or projector uh, to view Monday's solar eclipse. Monday is August 21st, 2017. So the eclipse is the moon going to the sun. That's right. <laughs> Well, it's not going to be scary, and it is this moon going in front of the sun. It doesn't happen all the time. We're excited about it. We do not have uh, NASA-approved solar eclipse glasses, uh, and I'm not comfortable with the kids, you know, looking at the sun directly. So I figured doing a binocular projection to view the eclipse may be the best bet. For today's project, we are going to need a cardboard box, um, kind of a stiff one to hold and support the binoculars okay we're also going to need a pair of scissors some tape and a pencil where's the pencil we lost the pencil all right so let's put it all right so let's get started we've cut out the box as we can see we've got our extra piece to add support now we're going to use the tape to tape this together. Again, this is just adding support so it can hold up our binoculars, which is kind of heavy. All right, so here's the tape and here we go. So here we go, all taped up. We'll we will reinforce the tape at a, another time. And then next we're gonna draw some draw some eye pieces so the binoculars can go through. Just who like wants me. to who wants to draw me, me. trace the okay so Divya you do one and Vidya will do the other one. So next what we're gonna do is cut it out and mommies and daddies have to be doing this okay as you can see we're all done yeah. we've got our binoculars in we had to tape and reinforce this actually dad had to help us and now we're gonna take it outside for a test run another thing that you'll need will be a white or light colored piece of cardboard so we're downstairs there's no Sun outside we're gonna have to wait a few minutes. It must be covered by a cloud. And we're just gonna take a minute to look at Garud. Hi, Garud. So the idea here, guys, is to get an image of the sun onto your projection. Once you have that, you should be able to be able to view the eclipse as it happens on Monday. You will see the moon crossing in front of the sun. And you can adjust the, uh, the binoculars to make the image crisp. We'll play around with it, but that's pretty much what the, uh, the gist of this whole thing is. And of course, holding it still. <laughs> mm -hmm. 